Hi guys. Um, welcome back to another video, and uh, we're gonna be continuing our go kart. So last time we did this, uh, we added, we made the steering wheel work. We did all this. Here, let me show you. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna select on an anchor. So last time we got this camera, third person, and we got first person. Then we got W, we got S, we got A, and we got D. Uh, I have to change the rotation of the, uh, what is it called, the steering wheel. But after I do that, I think, oh, uh, yeah, um, there's a glitch where it thinks I'm still in my chair, but I'm not, um, I don't know why, I just gotta reset, um, so, basically, uh, we're gonna be doing detail today and we're gonna we're gonna do uh, some stuff so first we're gonna just do stuff um so first of all we're gonna select all make sure the transparency is zero on everything if i can get it to work and reverse rotation for the servo um what else Oh yeah, uh, I wanted to move the servo back a little bit, right, so let's use scale tool zero, oh man, dang, that's, uh, that's rough, oh wait, no, that that's actually pretty good, okay, so go kart, save, yeah okay now we're gonna get some plastic right um uh you actually have to turn everything on invisible because if it's not then you don't know where the servo is and you could cancel out its uh its move so you kind of have to turn everything on invisible. I just wanted to show you guys what it would look like. Um, uh, what else? Scale tool zero. Like, like that. Now, when now we're doing that. Actually, let's turn this a little bit farther. Like that. Yeah, that looks good. Uh, like that? Or no, that doesn't actually, now that I'm thinking about it. Now that I'm like looking at it and it's bigger, doesn't look that good to me. That looks good. I mean, it doesn't matter, right? I, this is kind of just like how I like it. But you guys can make it however you want. Cause this is your build. Um, I'm just the producer basically, showing you how to make it. Um, so, uh, oh boy, uh, like that, I think it was before. So right now I would save, I actually save a lot because you know, if your internet crashes and you don't save a lot, then you're not gonna have a lot. This is my motto, I think. I'm not sure, but you know, it's whatever. Uh, la la la, bam. Let's scale it in a little, too, and make it come out. 
Okay, that should be good. If you hear sweeping, uh, it's because my mom is coming back from out of town. So my dad is doing the last um, couple of touches of cleanup. We were just cleaning up. Right, Dad? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, the reason I use plastic is, yes, it has one HP and it is very weak. And you might be wondering, why would I use plastic? And that's because it's the best coloring block in the game. And I want color. So, you know, I'm kind of using this for detail. Right, that's one of the very good tips I have for you guys. That's my tip of the day. If you want to do detail, I would recommend using plastic. It is the best coloring block in the game. Uh, because unlike some other blocks, it will not... Uh, it will not... You know, when you click a color and you decide to color it that color, it won't just color like, ha like it's darker or it's lighter than it's supposed to be. It does it like actually how it's supposed to be. Um, if you guys have the clone tool or you're just, you know, doing this again, um, I would recommend you would, you still have to scale it in anyways, because, you know, um, it's not going to be perfect. So there's that. And then you, I'm going to add a back and some neon. Also, guys, if you guys are YouTubers and you're watching, right, especially Jelistic, um, I'm a big fan of Jelistic. If anyone's ever watching this and you make um, a video on, like, the Reddit, right, and you say, yeah, I copied this, um, you're not actually copying if it's from my video because it's a tutorial. This is a tutorial, and I don't even know how to make it. So, um, it's not copying, it's just using my idea. Basically, how do I put this? Um, I'm just going to put it a different way some other time, but yeah. Uh, so, here's mostly the go-kart. Now, how I'm going to color this is I'm going to take some neon. Because as you know, cars, er, yeah, cars have, have tail lights so that you know which way a car is going. That's actually what they're for. So that you know that if you see the green part of a car's lights or a blue part or whatever, you know to get out of the street because that means it's coming for you it's coming toward you if you see the red part then you're fine because it's heading away from you because it's hard to tell which way a car is heading when it's far away so you know that's kind of what the lights are for now what am i going to do with this uh, I'm just gonna turn it fully invisible. Right? Actually, you know what? No, not fully invisible. 75% invisible. 75%. Right? So that I can still see where the wood is. Um. I don't know why this is so loud, but, uh. Now the reason you want a really, really dark green is because it'll cancel out the color, but not too dark of a green, like that kind of green. It's right here. You want that kind of green because that kind of green still gives it the glowing effect just without be it being like eye blinding. Like when you first place down neon, it's like really, 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 really bright. So the reason I just put that out right there was so that I could click it because you can't click it through the hood and then I can clone it and then I can scale it down. Um, like 
so okay now we're just gonna leave that wood 75% invisible now that this is all finished we're gonna turn the rest of the stuff that needs to be invisible invisible so this invisible we're gonna turn this invisible up oh. we're gonna turn this invisible uh we're about to see no it's not good enough okay uh Let's click this, turn this invisible, turn this invisible. We have to turn a lot of stuff invisible. Ah, don't tell me. I have, okay, good. And that's invisible. So that we got this, all we want left is this. So a go kart. Now, what I'm thinking is that the steering wheel is a little too high. I think the steering wheel is a little too high and we need to lower it, so. Okay, so let's go like this. Transparent Z0. Um, so, then what? Uh, I don't know, honestly. Okay, okay, here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna move this out. And we're gonna move this out. See, look, the um, servo didn't turn uninvisible. That's like one of the most important parts. So we're gonna move those out. And we're also gonna move uh, these out. But I want them to be touching, so that might be a little easier. We wanna move all those out. Now we're gonna select these and bring it down. Don't want that black part to be touching anything it's not yet we can actually bring it down more which I'm gonna okay like like that that should be good now let me make sure it's not touching is it that's not touching no it's not touching anything okay now what we can do is move this back in let's turn around and this back in now I wanna uh, that and now I can just move that in there. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Um, couple more things we need to turn invisible before we can color. Well, I don't think we can color yet because I'm gonna put a number. Um, you guys don't have to. Um, I think I'm gonna put a five. I'm gonna put a five. So I want plastic and splop that down right there. Then go like this, 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 like that. Now I'm gonna color these so that I just kinda know where they are. Do I need to? I'm. I just need to color that part. That's all I need to color. Just that part. So then we're gonna go like this. 
down a little and in. Actually, we already have the things we need now. Because now what we need to do is clone these things. We only needed the down and the up. Wait, what? It's only one block? Oh my god, it is. Mm, like that. hard right but it's all always worth it all those little details it's always worth it <coughs> Nina. no um what else we're gonna clone this so we're gonna be number five Numero five. And I'm gonna color all of these. This, this. Scale it in a little. And we got our number five. Okay, so I'm gonna save. Um, in case I lose connection. So let's save it. I feel like this part of the five should be out more. Yeah, that looks good. Okay. And turn this invisible. And then I'm gonna paint my car red. Um. So just paint this all red real quick. Ah, uh, hmm. Can I make this any different? Can I make these darker? I can. Hmm. That loses its color. Red seventy three percent of that. What happens if oh I do those? Hmm. Let's do that. Actually that looks pretty good. Okay, number five and the leaderboard. And we're gonna take black, bam, 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 bam. So it's got black wheels, we got Zeg, go-kart, save, yes. Okay, we got our go-kart. Okay guys, so that is the go-kart completed. Next video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how exactly you're supposed to troll your friends by putting weapons on it. So we're gonna click E. As you can see, we can drive around. We can drive over to this guy's base. We can drive over to that guy's base. We can drive over to anyone's base. We can just go bam. What's up, bro? I mean, if I had a weapon, I could, I would blast him right now. But I mean, I think this is pretty cool. The the whole go-kart. 
Mm. Next time we're gonna fix the steering wheel because see I'm turning the wheel but it's not turning so next time we're gonna fix that guys. Maybe, I don't know. Okay guys, that's gonna be it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed, always leave a like so that I can spend more Robux on this if I need to. We got a little Zeg over here. He's going to be fine. Um, thanks, Zeg, for coming out and driving our go-kart. Um, I'm guessing that the front of this got destroyed right now. Um, Zeg did a magic trick. Don't worry. He's, he's fine. Um, okay, uh, next video I'm going to be showing you guys how to make it um, lethal. Okay, um, that's it, bye.